Hey there, it's Pam from Our Adventures Everywhere, and I've got some fun ideas for you this week as always. Um, tomorrow, is it tomorrow? Well, anyway, it's the, the 7th, I think that's tomorrow. The 7th is chocolate day, hashtag chocolate day. So obviously, go enjoy some chocolate. Um, you could make a chocolate cake or chocolate chip cookies or just have a piece of dark chocolate, which is probably what I'll do. So anyway, make sure you celebrate that day. It'll, you know, chocolate gives you good endorphins and there's so many good brands out there. So maybe try a new brand. That might be something fun to do too. Uh, the other day this week is actually, there's two fun things on the same day and that's 7-Eleven, which is free Slurpee day. So if you have a 7-Eleven nearby you, head over there and grab a Slurpee and enjoy that um, for the kids. And then it's also Mojito Day. So if you are an adult, you might make yourself a mojito that night. That's probably what I'll do. And I've noticed at a few restaurants we've been to lately, they've also been making nojitos, which are the non-alcoholic version for the kids. So you could all have a nojito or a mojito for dinner that night. Um, Mojitos are fun. They're the favorite um, drink of Hemingway, if you didn't know that. So another way you could celebrate Mojito Day is to go get a Hemingway mo um, novel and read a little bit of it while you're sipping on a mojito. And the birthplace of the drink is actually in Havana, Cuba. So that might be something else to do is look a little bit of history on where mojitos came from, how they were first made, and um, you know a little bit of history even on Cuba. So a couple fun things for that day. So hopefully you'll enjoy these couple days this week. Um, I'll have more days next Monday to share with you. And next week they are not food once again. So it's something a little bit different. So anyway, have a great week.